Greetings and welcome back to High Rise City. I'm Catherine Sky, and um, I had a comment um, yesterday, which kind of like was okay. I got I got a bit. Whoa! How do I get out of this? Jesus! I hate that mode, and I press a thing, and I don't know how I get into it. It's probably a hotkey. Anyway, uh, yesterday the intro was a bit passionate, but that's who I am. I am very passionate. And believe me, if I uh, didn't care about this game, I wouldn't have said anything at all. I wouldn't have even played it all. Uh, the reason I do give feedback is because I care about the game, because I, I think it's kind of cool. I think it's very, um, it is unique. I, I've seen a lot of comments, oh, this is just city skylines. No, it's not. It's completely different. <laughs> have you ever played either game? You know, that's how I feel. It's like, have you seen my video, actually? Because this is nothing like City Skylines. Um, it looks like a city builder, but it's kind of like Anno. It's actually like Anno, where you have to build a lot of resources um, to support your population, that kind of thing. So it is very different, and I hope that you will see the differences, and it should be fine, I hope. All right, let's see. We needed, <clears throat> we needed, I think we need more iron, really. And what I'm not, uh, I'm not understanding why this is still full. The local garbage collector, is this because we just have, oh, maybe we don't have enough pickup trucks, like as in garbage pickup. Can we upgrade this thing? Let's see. Let's see if we can uh, do a build. Somebody told me that the um, that the garbage uh, power plant is actually in here. High voltage pylon. Uh, so one of the brackets is missing here, I think. Some kind of a tagging element here. Gas, solar, medium, solar, biogas, nuclear. Oh, there it is. Yep, okay. So that rant was unjustified. I just didn't see it. I thought it would be closer to this end because we get it sooner than the nuclear power station because that one isn't even unlocked yet. So that for me was like a weird sorting issue. Uh, okay, anyway. So let's look at our garbage thing. Local garbage collector, city garbage collector. That would be nice, but we don't have enough wood or iron for this yet. It's 5,000 per, per month uh, or per whatever. This is only 250. Wow, why would we do that? Hmm. We're not selling this to zero, are we? Oh, because we just built stuff, of course, that's why. All right. Anyway, um, I don't think that these tiles have to be adjacent. So I'm just going to go off the assumption that they don't have to be and maybe put another garbage collector that covers a different part of the town. Uh, right. So, okay. We now have stuff. Six garbage dumps can't be built. What? Oh, maybe I, I clicked the wrong one. Okay. So this one, it doesn't tell me. Okay, so this one collects this entire area. Okay. Garbage collector. I guess we can just do kind of the same thing. It doesn't really matter, I feel. Let's just put this one here and see if that's the issue. I, I kept thinking it's the dump filling up, and I got confused because, like, it's like there are tiles that are missing stuff. So I don't know. Uh, so now we know, I think that um, that it was an issue with trucks, not with uh, tiles. Okay, so what do we got here? Two buildings have no water. Those, it, this is one of them. Let's get some water connections going on. Let's just fix the problems we have. Someone noted the other day, no wonder I missed such and such a thing because like there's so much... Uh, stuff on the screen. I would agree with that. And thank you for understanding. There is a lot of stuff on the screen. <laughs> okay. This is the other one. Okay. Yep. That's fair. That's fair. This is like SimCity where you don't even care where the, uh, 
rivers are. You just lay the, lay this thing straight through, and it's fine. Okay, we need more offices. Really? Okay. You need offices, really. Hmm, interesting. Um, I'm going to put some over here, I think. Put these offices out here. And hopefully that's close enough. These guys are what? These are apartment buildings. Oh. Do they need offices as well? They need health care, these people do. Mm. And religion and other things. These. So these are not contributing to money. So we technically don't really care. Do we? Not really. This is very big. Okay, um, let's see. What else do we want to do here? These are garbage issues, right? So we need more offices, it says. I do feel like we probably need more um, wood harvesting and stuff. Uh, these guys... I think I can replace like one of these with a um, a medium one instead of having two. We can just replace it with a medium one because the medium says they plant trees. And I don't know if these don't plant trees. It doesn't seem like the trees are missing, you know. It really doesn't. It seems like they're pretty okay over here. Um, they cut more wood and plants more trees. But maybe that would help us with our sawmill. We are lacking trees right now at the sawmill. I don't know why that is. We seem to have tons of them here. Well, not tons. A few, at least. Um, okay. I think I would like definitely another plank maker. So can we... I want to get a delivery of these, please. So we're not, we're not using our tool area at all. And so I'm a little bit surprised that we don't have any of this other stuff. This guy's got plenty of wood to make charcoal. Okay, that's not the issue. Are we lacking iron? Because we turned it up last time. Iron, we still have 50 iron. That's, that's how much we had last time, actually. So maybe we're at perfect production right now. Um, what does this mean? Sell resources. Oh, okay. So this is our trade. That's cool. I'm liking that, that that's displayed. That's quite nice. That's cool. All right. We don't have a lot of veggies. What is this? Oh, that's wheat. Okay. Have a little bit of bread. Okay. So, oh man, the other garbage dump is also full. All right. Or garbage. Yeah. Garbage collectors. Let's put that here. Get another one. Why not? Recycling center. Oh, they recycle into wood. Hey, that's pretty nice. You can also do insulation. All right, cool. I like that. Differing prediction. Fun. All right, boards. We have a few now. So, uh, where's that iron? Yo, we asked you to pick this up. Truck's already on the road. You guys are taking the long way around, man. Taking the long way around. What are these guys driving with this insulation all the way on this side of the map? These guys should be picking that stuff up. Hmm. I feel like I should make this smaller a bit. Well, that doesn't help anyway. I just wanted to limit it to these farms, but because of the positioning, it's still getting all of this stuff. I guess I should... Look, I can make these closer. Maybe that's what I should do. Let's just do like really close in stuff here like that. Make these both this uh, closer in. Mm. Yeah, something like that to skip those main farms over there. Uh, all right, you two. You also, I want to reduce your thingy just to there, to the forest. Okay, very good. Now they should be a little bit more directed, I hope. 
Uh, and now we have no iron. Where's the iron? Is it still in the road? Where is this iron? Hello? You guys need what? T-shirts and stuff. We need to give them T-shirts. And looks like fruit is also short. Uh, this is the fruit thing. So what I'm wondering here is, um, should I make this whole thing a fruit square? I am considering it and just moving this logger elsewhere. Can we, we can move this to like here maybe. And move the charcoal kiln as well. All right. Uh, because this one remembers near this production facility, that planning office. So I think I'm going to do that. Um, how much does this cost, though, to build? Probably a lot. Uh, if it's this big of an area. What I'm going to do is I'm going to delete these apartment buildings. Uh, for now. Um, and then probably these houses as well. This area. And then connect the road here. Eh. Why is this not working? No. There we go. No. No. <laughs> Don't do this thingy. Behave yourself. Can we do this? No. That doesn't look good. No. Look thing. I'm trying to click this. And you are not letting me click it, are you? Can we do... We can actually do a curved road, maybe? Let's try this. Uh, that's not what I wanted. Maybe we do this and then curve like that. Collision. What if we did... Here to like, no, stop clicking the wrong thingy thingy. No, still a collision. Okay. Can we do free form? Like here to there. No, it doesn't want to do it. We'll just do a straight one here. So, so you can draw curved roads. I clicked that right there and it still went to the other node. That is bizarre. Um, Hello? Hello? Mm. I might have to delete this road. Okay, that's left some weird gaps. Is that actually a road? No, nope, they stopped there. So this is a very unhappy situation here. Uh, we also deleted our pylon there. Okay, this is a tiny bit of a mess here. So what I'm going to do is we're just going to redo these roads because I don't want them to be, like, bugged. So we're going to do that. Okay. And we're going to go there. Or are we? We're going to go here, actually. Oh, no. Oh, no. We have... Okay, apparently this building was on a not straight area. Okay, now that's going underneath. So what about this one? There we go. We can do this. This farm needs to be re rebuilt. Maybe. That's a hemp farm. We don't actually need another hemp farm. I want to delete this hemp farm. I forgot we had like three. I forgot about this one completely. I was like, hemp farm? What? We can actually make that into a vegetable farm or whatever we're lacking. I forget if it's fruits or vegetables we're lacking right now. Okay. And then this one, we delete this road. And we replace this farm. Too bad you can't move farms and like save a little bit of money uh ow that hurt so yellow is what fruit uh all right let's see um so fruit farm yo let's go how much is this space is what no Okay, I guess we got to chop it off then. That is really disappointing when I just made this space just for that. Uh, and also now the pylons are in the way. All right, let's just try to make this space a little bit smaller. Let's try it now. 
fruit farm. Production 18. So maybe that means we can do a slightly bigger production of 20. Let's see if we can just sneak this in. Okay, why not? Half crazy wonky sideways roads, we don't care. I think it looks more interesting as well. It's more realistic to real life. Having been to many places, I can tell you it's definitely more realistic to real life. Places have wonky roads all the time. So, uh, all right, this is turning into a slight nightmare. Okay, so let's see. Let's try to do this again. And then add a smaller section, like there. Delete this part. How does that work? Fruit farm. 19. Dudes, are you joking here? Uh... I want 20. I suspect that 20 is the limit, right? Okay, let's try road angle too small. All right, let's delete this. Okay, so this, this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, let's try one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just put this here to there. Trying it one square at a time, because that's how this game wants to run. Instead of allowing us to just make a farm that has X amount of fields, you have to do this silly... This is this is a little bit annoying. 20, finally. Okay, we can live with this, maybe. Sort of. It's fine. Um, all right, cool. Now we take our pylons across. Um, I'm going to take... I'm going to remove these pylons from the from the road area because most buildings need to be on a road, right? So I'm going to move them to the middle of the square if possible and just have crossings next to the road. So let's see, we can do something like this. Yeah, that's, that's okay. Uh, the diagonalness is not great, but Actually, we'll do this. That's better. So there's no diagonalness. And then across the field is just fine. We don't care about the field. Farmers can go around. What is going on now? Okay. We just... It should be fine. Okay. So now these people don't have electricity. Why? Why? None of these buildings moved. I don't I don't understand this. Now they don't have water. Why don't they have water? We This is a substation. Why don't we have water? We have no people working here. Okay. Big water tower. Is this not working? It is. How did we get from fine to zero water? I do not understand this. I really am not understanding. Now it seems to be okay. Five buildings don't have water now. This is um, not ideal. This is not ideal. So these all should have water. Also, these gar these garbage places are totally overloaded, apparently, which I also don't understand. How can you need five five uh, city garbage dumps for this size of a city? This is ridiculous. This is absolutely ridiculous. Okay, we're missing. Oh, whoops. We're, we're missing wood? How can we be missing wood? Like, that doesn't even seem possible. All right. Um, I think I want to upgrade one of these places. Uh, we don't have the iron. Again, how can we not have iron? 
We've just spent all this time doing other things. The iron should have built up by now. I don't get it. I don't understand. Okay, so is there anything that we're missing? Okay, we're missing vegetables and more fruit. Now, we just made more fruit. So how can we be missing fruit? Because nobody is bothering to deliver it. That would certainly help. I hate that I have to click these things. That's that's one of the frustrations. It's like, this should have should be, you know, this should be taken care of. This should be automatic. This is a vegetable farm, which is way too small. So I'm going to delete it and build it in a bigger space. Let's see, vegetable farm. I feel like using the production building on farms and stuff is a good use because um, the, the, the farms just take so much space. That, that seems to be, a, oh my God, where, why money? Oh my God, the money. Dude, what is happening with our money? It's the fruit and the vegetables. And, the, oh. so this is a reason for me to kind of rage quit the game. Honestly, this is like, this shouldn't be happening. Like this doesn't even make sense, you know? Minus 26,000 when the population hasn't grown substantially to be lacking all of this stuff. So now the fruit is down to like almost nothing. The vegetables are also down before it used to be just fine. Granted, I did add a couple of more buildings there, but that shouldn't require huge amounts of farming. This is really confusing and it's very frustrating. Like this just doesn't even make sense. Look at this, 36 vegetables. Why are there 36 fruits building up here? Why are they not like, why are these trucks? They're not even full, not even close. These are at a quarter of capacity and they're still not delivering this stuff to the supermarket. I don't get it. I don't, I don't understand how this is working or not working as the case may be. This is, this is so weird. Like, yeah, the fruit satisfaction is huge, and now it's at zero. This doesn't make sense, game. And now we're bleeding money like crazy. Now this company is not doing anything, so maybe we need to increase this to do the farms. Because apparently these three companies, four companies, can't get the job done. I think that's just ridiculous. It just doesn't even make sense. Like this whole thing doesn't make any sense. I'm just going to go ahead and increase them again because this just doesn't, I, I don't get it. I, I don't understand this. I have tried to understand this and this is a reason to rage quit the game. Honestly, these kind of systems that are supposed to be automated um, and working, they just don't work at all. They really don't work. And it's so, so frustrating to try to, uh, you know, make, make something happen and it just doesn't happen. Um, and these are supposed to be automatic, like completely automatic. So yeah, I don't even know what to do about that. Honestly, I have no idea what to do about that. So I don't know. I don't know don't know. <sighs> so now we're at minus 10,000. Great. Hooray. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and build some more offices because those don't eat food. Let's try just medium offices over here. They do require garbage, but they don't eat food. That's great. That's excellent. So engineers are unhappy because they don't have all the products they need, which is fair. Uh, it does look like I need another city garbage collector. So I'll go ahead and grab one of those. But yeah, again, this, this money thing is insane. This just doesn't make sense. What are we missing now? Boards. Oh yeah. We just built stuff. Okay. That's fine. Um, the fruit. 
Now it's at half. Okay. And yet, we built this huge area for fruit. Maybe we need to convert one of these areas for fruit. Actually, what we could do is expand this place. Uh, and make that bigger. We could make this bigger for fruit. Maybe even make another one for fruit, since fruit seems to be this uh, very, very precious commodity. Okay, we'll do that. What are these? These are the part fire department. I'm going to move those into this tile instead. All right, you go here. Thank you. Um... Because we're going to need a lot of boards, I think, for, for this new fruit farm. We could just build another one, actually. And that, that'll give us an idea of how much is needed. Okay, so we need 40 boards and 20 bricks. So we need both of those. Those those will those will come up in a second. We're bleeding money like crazy because of some kind of magical game mechanics that no one can read. No one can read these things. All right, let's let's check on our uh, wheat production. Wheat. Um, <laughs> okay, we don't have enough wheat, we don't have enough flour, and we don't have any bakery products. That's great. That seems wonderful. All right. Um, I'm going to build another wheat farm. I thought about extending this one, but I think it's going to be expensive, and I don't want to have no wheat while we're trying to figure out the wheat. So we'll go here, do kind of a water contact. Okay. Let's just, oh, I have to delete the whole thing apparently. Okay, great. Okay, we'll do that. We'll have the wheat farm here. All right, we need the wheat farm, uh, but let's get that fruit farm going because that's just basic, basic stuff. All right, where is the wood, people? Yo, we need wood. Did, I didn't upgrade one of these. Okay, we didn't upgrade. I thought I did. Um, thankfully, they don't require wood. This is a small... Okay, so let's delete the small one here. We only need one. <gasps> no! No! Ah, oh, I accidentally... I was clicking on this because I didn't think I had it selected. Because I thought... Yeah, I, I don't know. It just didn't look like... See, I thought I had it selected and it wasn't. And I deleted my freaking... Uh, oh, well. I guess we don't need the wind turbine. It's fine. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's fine. It's fine. I think I can build another small sawmill, though. Maybe we can build a bigger one. Can we build a bigger sawmill? Do we have access to that? Medium logger. Large logger. There's no bigger sawmill. Okay. Sure. Sawmill does need a road, so we'll just put it here. Sure. Um, I'm hoping that will get us some more stuff. Do we have logs? No. Not a lot. We don't have a lot of wood. So maybe having another sawmill is not Mm, not good. I don't know. Minus... Does that say 43,000? Are you joking, game? Trade. Oh, God. Okay, it's the tools, right? I'm going to stop trading for tools right now. Let's just put that down to, like... Well, let's just take them off altogether. I'm also going to take off bricks... Uh, we want to sell bricks down to 80. That's fine. Yeah, that's, that's what, okay, that was a big trade deficit, but. All right, where, where were we? We were building this farm here. Okay. Industry thing. Fruit farm. It's fruit, right? That people are complaining about all the time. Oh, now they're not complaining anymore. We should have mountains of money. Why don't we have mountains of money? They are fully satisfied on fruit. Even though we're not getting the full amount of money from the fruit. Hmm? Yes, we're only getting 124. 
instead of 152. Same thing on vegetables. Why is this? Oh, it's because there's not enough people in there, I guess. Oh, this game, man. This game. Uh, we need more of this stuff for sure. Kind of wish you can place a building and then it would like, you know, get the stuff over time. But let's see, what are, what are our limits on the trade menu here? 80. Mm, that should be enough, I think, for this stuff. But um, we are going to have to get more tools made. So I'm going to go ahead and put in like 20% of the workers for now. And they can, they can do stuff now. This is, uh, yeah. Okay, at least we're, we're plus 9,000 now. Hooray! But I feel like the, the swing with stuff like the fruit and stuff like that is absolutely insane. It just feels like you're not able to plan properly, not able to build the city properly. It feels kind of bad, like really bad. So now we're at plus money. I mean, I understand when we're importing stuff that that give us, gives us a big deficit, but man, the the thing with the fruit and stuff, that's not cool. That's really not cool. So this, textiles are not worth a lot. Spices are not either. Furniture is the same as textiles. Yeah, bread is, is big business here. We really need some more wheat. But it's going to take a lot of... Oh, we're at one time speed. No wonder everything's so slow. I was like, why is this not happening? Come on. Let's see. Furniture just needs logs. That's easy. I can make this. We can get some money. All right. Where did the logs... Uh, they're here now. Maybe we just build another logger. Why don't we... Okay. Can we... We need that iron, please. We need the iron. I could just put a small logger down as well. Eh. It's probably going to get transferred to here, which is annoying to me. Eh. I feel like we can never get enough. We probably need another uh, smelter. But they're so expensive to run. I don't... Well, now we have plus 19,000. I guess we can afford to now. <sighs> God. I do feel like this game is extremely, like... I don't know. It just feels crazy sometimes. I think we definitely need another iron mine here. Um, because now we don't have enough iron. And that's going to affect this, obviously. So let's see. I think what we need to do. Oh, we have we have iron. Oh, let's let's slow down. Let's slow down. Oh no 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 no! Go away. I need to I need to cancel that hotkey. Whatever the hotkey is that's causing me this stress, I need to cancel it. Uh, all right. Let's see. You, there, more. All right. That's another thing. So now, I, I didn't even think about the furniture that it's literally one extra building. I think that that's very, very acceptable to have. Let's put in two of these. We probably need more uh, loggers. Um, I'm going to go ahead and grab another logger, actually. Okay, we don't have enough stuff for them. No. Oh, it's a tools now. Hmm. When we get a little bit more money... Like over, say, 400,000, I can buy tools again. <laughs> They're so expensive. I don't want to buy them under because, like, it's money. It's lots of money. Oh, no. I dare not add any more residential because of reasons now. Um, these people are unreasonably happy, I feel. Some. Huh. Feels like this should be much higher. I don't know. Um, this this just feels like a crazy game. I have to say, it's so 
kind of beyond comprehension here of how anything is supposed to work. It feels like all of these systems don't work most of the time. See, this is 520. Wow. I need to delete these wind turbines because they're like, so this is 550 for 10,000, 520 for 20,000. I think those, that's a better deal to get this, to get a solar plant running. Let's see. I'm going to go ahead and just build another solar plant. And this is just a small one as well. We need six tools for this though. Eh, we don't have the six tools. Come on. Come on. Get the tools picked up. Like, how long does it take to drive there? Not that long. All right. Keep on building these um, business buildings here. We'll just use the medium ones again. Because they're definitely more affordable. We can maybe rezone later. I don't know if they allow rezoning in this game. I have no idea. What are we looking for? Okay, we are looking for all the things here. We are looking for engineers, but I dare not build more population until we can really get stable and make sure that we can feed everyone, have extra food maybe. That would be nice to have actually extra. Now we have way too many planks. What the heck? <laughs> oh, no. This game, it feels like... It, it's either a desert or it's pouring monsoon rains. No, beyond monsoon, like flooding rains. This is just nuts. And it feels very random. Like, you don't feel like you know what to expect. It, like, literally just feels random. And that is not a good feeling for a game, I have to say. I don't like that feeling for a game. How are there 0.4 tools here? How does that even work? I don't understand this at all. All right, well, I'll wait till there's a full tool before picking it up. I guess what we could do is, if we look at the trade menu, I'm not patient for this stuff at all, man. Uh, let's see, if we buy tools, they cost how much? 2,000 a piece, okay. So 2,000 times, if we say up to 10, that would be 20,000. Okay, that, that's buyable. I think that's okay. We can do that. What is that bell, by the way? I have no idea what the bell means. There's a lack of fish. They want us to transport stuff. We know how that goes. Construct new buildings, medium logger, task complete. Oh my God, I didn't even know. Lack of bakery products. I know about that part. Are we really lacking fish? I don't see anybody hungering for cold smoked salmon or hot smoked, if you prefer. Um, I like both, but like nobody is complaining about a lack of fish. So what are you guys talking about? In fact, we probably have a ton of fish. We don't have a ton of fish. We have some fish. We do have a ton of vegetables and fruit though, like much vegetables and fruit. Let me just sell those. Wow. Let's sell vegetables. 220? Are you joking? Wow, that's nice. Let's keep um, 80 in stock. Uh, that's a nice price. We can make some money off that. That's really nice. Okay. Uh huh. And fruit, we can probably also sell some of that. Too bad we can't sell our garbage. Uh, let's see if we can build another port. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we sure can. That gives us one extra cell slot, I believe. Gotta wait till it's built. There it is. Let's sell vegetables and we'll keep 80. Those are only worth 120. That's interesting. Uh, but it's still it's still a lot of money. So why not? Now the, we are selling planks. Those are worth a hundred. That takes even two levels of processing. Dang. Some of the prices kind of should have some adjustment, I think. Um, but anyway, yeah, too bad we can't sell the garbage. Oh, well. 
Uh, this fruit farm also could be expanded maybe a bit or removed. I think we can remove that once we get this fruit farm going. So, all right, we have something. What do we need for another wheat farm? Let's see, this wheat farm needs 54 tools. Holy crap. Uh, that's a lot of tools. But, however, 50 tools times 2,000 would be 100,000 money. We already have 360,000, so I think we can actually afford that. Uh, but we need to cancel the order right after we do it. So let's get 50, 55 tools, okay? It's going to be expensive, and we're going to cry. We're going to cry, Rivers. There we are going to go. Oh, my God. Yes, we are. We're going to cry, but it will be fine. We will just try not to cry too much. Just cry a little bit. Hmm? Let's do, uh, let's see, these are expensive on the bricks, but that's okay. I want to, I want to make sure that if we have office group C or something, we have enough. So we need more engineers. I'm scared, but we do apparently have stuff. We have food, you know, we do have food. All right, we are getting tools, obviously. Uh, we need a little bit more, so I'm going to wait. a One more trade should give us... I wish there were ships, man. Why do we not see ships here? I mean, I don't even care if they coincide with the trades, because then I'd have to be going, like, really fast. But, like, having just a boat on the water would be so pretty and so nice. I like ships a lot. Like, a lot. I am very keen on ships. Do we have, we have 65 tools. Okay, so now I'm gonna take tools off. Just off, just don't, just ignore them. So now what I wanna do is we probably need more bricks by now uh, because we did build some stuff, but I think it'll be good to, oh, we have toys. What do those need? Oh, they need, oh, they need iron. Oh, that's great. We love making iron. <clears throat> Sarcasm off. Um. Right, wheat. Focus on the wheat. Wheat needs... All right, we need more wood. Really? Over 100 wood? Holy crap, that's a lot. Uh, looks like we also need over 100 bricks. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put this up to max for now. And just let this stuff collect because I just... Yeah. Mm-hmm. I do think we earned a lot of money with the with the veggie sales and stuff and fruit food sales. So that's good. That's really good. Uh, that, that helped us buy our tools and not put us in the hole financially. So that's a nice thing. So I'm going to try to save up some of this stuff. Iron thingies. We I feel like this should go faster. This place, they have full production. They have plenty of materials. But it just feels really, really slow for some reason. Maybe because we are getting tools from here. Maybe that's the thing. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so what do we got now? Lack of fish that doesn't exist. Lack of bakery products that does exist. We They want us to make a new bakery. I'm not going to build a new bakery because that's going to be expensive, I think. Oh, here's another haul haulage company, of course. So these bakeries, they're costing us 1300 per period. Um, so there's, yeah. Why do these have zero in this flower place? Okay, they finally delivered stuff from the flower place. Are either of these bakeries going to get this? Look, it's just down the street. How far you got to go with that flower? Dudes. And they've already made 13 more in this same amount of time. Okay, they, they sort of distributed it evenly, which is good. That's preferable, of course. This one has now zero. That's not good. I think it's definitely a ratio of one to three or something like that. But it's so hard to tell because... The deliveries really aren't uh, aren't aligned very well, I think. It feels that way. All right. Uh, 
I feel like I'm going to be building this wheat farm the entire episode. It definitely feels that way. All right, so we just need 12 more magical bricks and five more of the other things. Five more bricks. Oh, five more iron. Iron is what we need. Let's go and see if we can pick up the iron. And I'm going to turn this off for now. Just turn it off so it doesn't get any more iron. So that all that eight iron comes to hopefully the central container for iron. Yay. Oh my God. All right, wheat, let's go. Now, of course, the other problem is that we, um, okay. I'm going to turn on this tool maker again, again to 20% seems okay. Um, Okay, you're, oh, you're lacking electrical stuff. Interesting. Okay, so that means we need another substation. Okay, to cover that area. And we're going to need another connection. So probably we'll put it through the center of this. Oh, no. Maybe this will be a farm. And we'll put it through the center of this thing. Maybe we'll have, like, housing there or something. I don't know. Um, all right. Substation. Can we make a bigger one? No, I don't think so. We can. We can make a bigger one. Oh, yes, we can. Okay, that's a bigger one. Collision. This is a medium one? This looks the same as, well... Mm, slightly bigger, I guess, than the others. Something like here. Would need to be like there, I think. Hmm. We could put it like on the corner here, like that. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to place it there and then put the roads as close as possible. And that's going to look something like this. Maybe we'll have another farm here. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to leave that there. I'm going to... I can't move it? What? Ah, uh, that's annoying. Well, how much do these things cost? There are 20,000 monies. Also, they do not need a road connection. I, I didn't know that. Okay. Then that solves the problem really. And we can do crazy stuff like this. And this will just be like a farm, I think. Anyway. Um, so we're going to move the thing through here. I think I want this to be a farm or, or even better. I have a new idea. Yay. Uh, ha, 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 ha. We can go through the existing farms. Imagine that. Okay. Hooray. Okay, go there. And there. Beautiful. Okay, nice. So that's our electricity sorted. Hooray. These look really ugly, though, I have to say. They don't look nice at all on this landscape. They just, like, chop it into pieces. And it's just, it's like, uh, yeah, I mean, I know they're on the landscape, on the real life landscape, but it doesn't look nice on this landscape at all. It really is terrible. All right. Well, so did we, we did get our wheat farm. So that means I can make another, um, yeah, another one of these guys. Let's make some more roads here. I definitely want, go, go away thing. Shoot. I want to make another road here and go like, I guess we could even do this really because those buildings are quite small. Like the, um, the flower maker, the mill. So let's, let's get that. Let's get the mill. So rotate. So this needs three bakeries. One. Ah, can't build it. No. Um, 
So how much are those bakeries? How much do they cost? We need tools. Oh, darn it. Okay, you know what? We can start importing tools again. So we'll buy, buy tools and leave it up to like, I don't know, 30 or something for now. You know what? Let's go to 50. Just because we got the money. We're going to spend this cash. Yo. <laughs> Plus 3,000 monies. I, I don't I don't get it. I don't get it at all. It, this number just fluctuates. We have not increased our population at all. We have increased our money with the furniture quite extensively. And yet the money... Okay, that 60,000 is probably tools, so that's fine. But in general, it's like... Mm, why? Why? Bread is unhappy over here. We have unhappy bread. It's extremely inconvenient, as, as you might imagine. All right, let's get these bakeries fixed. Two more. Rotate. Yay. And yay. Okay, good. So even in these narrow areas, you can make into really productive areas if you just put your roads correctly. Uh, okay, so there we are. We have things and stuff. So they are yelling about things and stuff. So this is actually about the same area. This is 10.7, 7.6. This is actually bigger. Okay, nice. That's great. So that means we've basically, we have doubled our bread capacity. So that's good. So why is our money still down? I, I mean, it takes a little while to percolate, yes, but we are not denying them fruit. We have plenty of fruit things. Ugh. This game, it does kind of make me despair a bit, honestly. Uh, fruit farm. Let's make this fruit farm here. I think we can afford it. Yep. And then we can delete this fruit farm. And then what are we going to do next? I kind of want to make the clothing. Should we, should we investigate this even? Kind of like, hmm. It's clothing. Here's the clothing. It's a sheep farm that we need. We need four boards for this. Uh, what else do we need? We need... Uh, the textiles factory needs... Uh, yarn? Sheep farms don't make yarn. Sheep farms make wool. Wool needs to be spun. Well, carded... Uh, well, no, not just carded. Needs to be washed, carded, and then spun. That doesn't happen at a farm, usually. That's a factory. Textiles factory gets this magical yarn and paint. Where do we get paint from? I don't see paint in the menu here. Do we have to buy it? We might have to buy it. That's a bit scary. Okay. Um, wait. This sheep farm, are we saying we can't build this because we literally don't have enough storage space? We, yeah, apparently. Okay, all right. I guess we build another warehouse then. Um, wait, does this need a road? It does not. Okay, so I can put this in the middle of places, which is kind of great because I feel like... The middles are rarely used. So does that give me more space? Hello? Yes, 230 tons now. Okay, so we need... I can't believe we need that much thing for this. This this farm. It's literally a sheep farm. I guess you need to build the fences. Maybe they're building the fences out of wood. Like, just use wire, man. That's how we do it in the West. Just build out of wire. Okay, so textiles factory needs a road, I think. Yeah, okay. We'll just start building some of these over here. Can build it partly in the water. It's just fine. They can go swimming. They don't care. Actually, I could build one here if I move this like there. 
Yeah, you know what? They have a swimming pool in the backyard. It's just fine. We'll build this textile factory there instead. Uh, that seems okay. Hampson. That's a funny name. So we don't have any paint. I wonder where paint comes from. Do we have to build that somehow? Toys don't even need paint. How about we make toys out of like, you know, 3D printed stuff. We don't need metal for those. <laughs> oh, we need another port. Mm. We could build another port on this side. That would not be bad. Industry. No, this port. Porting. Definitely fit one there, at least. <sighs> Alright, let's click on this and open the trade menu. And now we can buy paint, because I don't see any other place to get this stuff, right? Let's keep an inventory of, say, 20. That should be enough, I would think, for two different um, factories right now. So how's our sheep farm going? Oh, look at that. How cute. Aw, they're so cute. There's a lot of sheep in this farm. <laughs> oh, they painted the fence. Are we joking? Maybe it's like weatherproofing. We can only hope. I do like the rounded corners. That is a nice, nice look. Why do we have fences around the farm dude we do not need a fence around the farm that is not needed that is not needed oh okay we now have problems with water and i think that's probably an issue of let's just upgrade this building under construction so that one was six thousand this is twenty thousand that seems better maybe okay so that should be settled we now have 10 paint and oh no, no, 10 and the other as well. That's good. Okay, so we're just waiting for some production here, I guess. Have we? We have. All right, we're just not picking it up. Yeah, the pickups in this game are really slow. It feels like you almost have to click it constantly. Maybe not constantly, but very frequently. Also, I'm going to increase the people doing tools here to like 40%. Because we are getting a big uh, chunk of iron right now. And I think if we do another episode, like sometimes this game just drives me crazy. Uh, if we do another episode, we need to focus on maybe making more iron. Even though now, like this, the money, this drives me nuts. Why is it fluctuating so much? Is this because we just bought paint and we didn't sell any fruit or what? Like, I don't understand this. We are actually now short on fruit and, and things. And we haven't increased the population, right? We haven't built any houses. The only things I've been building is commercial. Those don't require food. So why are we now having a shortage on fruit and veg? I don't get it. This game feels like it takes random numbers out of the air. And that's how this functions. Like literally. Um, and I find that super frustrating because I don't know what to do next. I feel like game can just punish you with no money or with some money or with it just it's insane this feels insane to play and it's not not a good feeling really not a good feeling so anyway i don't know if i'll make more videos on this uh it really is annoying to me um and and just it doesn't feel good to play because of this this uh the way that that things function here let's see we'll put that there um so yeah Anyway, I think this has a potential to be a good game, but I feel like there's so much random stuff or buggy stuff or stuff that's unexplainable by human minds. Um, it just doesn't feel good to play. It doesn't make sense. And it's just terrible uh, at times. So I hope that some of this gets ironed out because it, it, is, it does have potential. Like It seems like a cool game. But you can't play it if it just doesn't give you the tools to do so. Uh, and it's random. It feels very random. So, 
like this. How can this be 30% if all of these things, most of them are, I mean, some of these have higher modifiers, some big, little, um, but like, we also have this is, oh, that's little. What? I thought those were big. That's really strange. Cause I, I, before those used to be big, same thing with bread used to be big. And again, now we're running out of furniture when before we had plenty. And I have not increased the population. So there's some weird, weird mathematics going on in this game. I don't really get it. Uh, another thing that I have found lacking is the public transport. We don't seem to have any issues with traffic that are causing any problems. Um, I think we should have by now. Maybe there is a little bit of this. Maybe that's why we're not getting deliveries faster is because of that. But... It doesn't feel like public transport has much impact on anything uh, that I can see. Like, look look out here. There's absolutely nothing going on on these streets. So I haven't really even felt the need to, like, I guess we could upgrade the roads. Okay, so if we do this, road angle too small. Really? Dude. How do you, can you upgrade these things? Upgrade. Okay. So we're upgrading this. Uh, change road. No. So we've upgraded it. To four lanes. Okay, that seems good. I guess we can upgrade this one. I guess it happens instantly. I was kind of waiting for it to like, oh, is it going to be done? But I guess it just doesn't instantly. So, I don't know. I don't, I don't really understand how this works. But um, it doesn't really seem to have much impact. So the traffic thing is not... I mean, I don't care... I'm not really that interested in traffic management in a game like this where it's about production. Um, but anyway, the things that are random, the things like, you know, all of a sudden we have less fruit and vegetables. We have zero fruit right now. Zero. How? We had so much we were selling it at the port and now we have zero and we have not increased the population. I do not understand this at all. It doesn't make sense. So anyway, hopefully those uh, numbers will get ironed out and I might play it in the future. I think I've decided not to make any more videos right now, um, but it's been interesting. So uh, anyway, wishlist this on Steam, check it out. And um, yeah, uh, go ahead. If you enjoyed this video, do automate that like button and upgrade the subscribe button. Let people know uh, about this game, about my videos. Uh, tell your friends, family, colleagues, pester them. <laughs> and uh, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.